That's and also maybe export markets. That's right. That's why we have uh, uh, organized uh, exhibitions in the province and out of the province. And we participate in the several uh, exhibitions which have been organized by several countries. Now, uh, every year we are taking people to India, in New Delhi. Uh, there's a very famous, uh, uh, very popular um, exhibition. They call it uh, Tech Mart exhibition. Every year we are taking about 25 people from our uh, province. So how do you select the 25 people? Is it now, based on? Uh, their productions or how? Uh, no, that, that is uh, now actually we invite them. So uh, year by year there are people, some, some, some have improved a lot through TechMart. So they, they are willing to go each and every year because the TechMart is not just an exhibition which you can see things and come back, but there are several things that they can obtain from that exhibition they can gain so many things. So uh, they are going there and same time they are, we uh, encourage people to go there. Now this is something you know uh, they might, um, uh, when, we, when we talk about uh, exhibitions and all, people think that exhibition is such just an exhibition that you can go and watch things and come back. But uh, uh, in tech, exhibitions like TechMart, it's a marvelous uh, opportunity for the people who are in the field to go and watch this. So how many people are basically like statistics wise, I don't know whether you are aware, how many are sort of engaged in this wood carving, brass industry and handicrafts and artifacts and w is it a big percentage of the central province that are engaging in this industry? Uh, actually the, uh, in the province itself we have uh, as you said there are several segments in industry base. So uh, the handicrafts and the, uh, they are from the villages actually. Now, when when we talk about uh, handicrafts, the, we have some villages like Sigiriya, uh, and also there are individual people who are doing their own way, and some people have uh, improved and they have uh, benefited from the tourism, so they are doing in that scale. But so, uh, then what are the prospects for other small and medium industries, SMEs? No, uh, uh, in the industrial sector, uh, our industrial ministry, provincial ministry, uh, we have our own plans that uh, we, we take them uh, as the public-private partnership programs. This is not state programs. They are with the public and we, we have organized uh, uh, one association as well. So now the public can take part in this. So they, they, don't, they don't need to be very rich people or who are doing in master scale, but anybody can come into this uh, with us for these projects. So they are in a good, only thing is what you mentioned earlier that uh, for them to, uh, this, this production, to get money for this production, that part is actually we have to consider very, th we have to have a thorough consideration of this because we need to have a place for them. Right, so we are speaking with Mr. Sarat Ekanayaka, Chief Minister of the Central Province. So we will take a break, very short break, and we will be back with you soon.